All right, hey guys, uh, it's Sunday, Father's Day. Um, I don't know, my buddy and I got up early this morning and went and drove around a little bit. Um, I don't know, all the creeks are still a little bit full. Um, I don't know. Yeah, so we just drove around and did a little scouting. Um, all of our creeks that we like to hunt, seems like they've been getting pounded pretty hard this year. Um, I don't know, footprints... Um, everywhere it seems like so we're trying to branch out a little bit but I just wanted to get on here and make a video and show you a few things that I have um, that I found um, this one right here is this is the one that started it all for me um, yeah my buddy is you know when we got into it about four years ago or so um, my buddy took me and I found a couple broken pieces but this was the first full one right here that I ever found um, not really sure what those types are um, it's got like a snap back there it's not ground down to the base or anything but um, if anybody has any ideas on that what that is I'd sure like to hear their opinions about it but um, yeah I don't know I've put some videos up and not getting too many comments or ratings or anything so I'd love to hear from you guys. Um, I don't know, my buddy and I, my hunting partner and I are going to be putting up our all of our hunts from now on. I just got this uh, new iPhone. It has a pretty handy video camera on it and I've got a little shoulder strap. My, my buddies make fun of me, call it a shield. So I can put that on and wear it down in the creek so I don't have to worry about my phone uh, breaking. But yeah, um, love to hear from you guys. Um, Creek Comer sent me a message on that killer blade that my buddy, whoops, that my buddy found, and I didn't have a chance to get back to him, so I apologize for that Creek Comer. Um, but yeah, we're we're uh, we're just outside of Kansas City, not too far. Um, so yeah, but we're on the Missouri side of Kansas City. Um, but anyways, yeah, I don't know if any of you guys had a chance to watch that video of my buddy's blade that he picked up, but. It was it was a pretty good one, but yeah, here's just a few things that I found on. I mean, it's only got like four sandbars that are any good. My buddy and I found I don't know like ten pieces or so, like four full arrowheads um, after the rain. So, but yeah, this is some of the stuff I found in that creek, um, leading up to where my buddy found his blade. Found this nice little whatever it is, Sedalia or Nebo or something. And then this, uh, this one, I actually bent down to pick this one up, call my buddy over to show it to him before I picked it up. And, uh, it was actually right before I started videoing, but I bent down to pick this one up, which it would have been killer. Um, it would have been a really nice point. I mean, it's super thin, pink, would have been really nice, but I was picking that one up and turned around and saw that one in the mud right up against the bank. But, but, uh, this, this other little bird point here I found that one there too leading up to that big blade so uh, that was a really good spot for us this year and here's a I don't know my ultimate heartbreaker this is my Harden um, this little broken tip on it as you can see but would have been a super nice piece it's still uh, one of my favorites so um, but yeah definitely a heartbreaker would have been would have been a pretty awesome piece still is and then uh, this one here, it's it's uh it's really nice. It's um, I don't know what we call it, like hemp hills or cash rivers or whatever it is. Um, I don't know. We find a lot of those types around here though. Pretty nice. And a couple of my uh, sedalias or whatever you want to call them. This one has a pretty pretty uh, pretty noticeable ridge on it so I'm not exactly sure what those types are either if somebody wants to let me know and and this one I found this year it's pretty nice I was pretty excited to pick that up picked it up about a about a foot away from my buddy's foot so which that's always fun to do <laughs> so and then uh, I don't know one of my other very favorite pieces I have is this uh, 
it's uh it's just like a turtle back scraper um let's see if i can get a good some good light on it but it's pretty neat it's a uh, it's pretty lucky piece of mine i dug it out of some weeds down in the creek but my root beer flint thumb scraper i really like just a little tiny piece off the very top of it but it's pretty pretty detailed it's even flaked on that under the bottom side a little bit at the top flaked up there so I don't know I don't know if you guys are into that those kinds of things but I love them so scrapers and stuff like that I, I enjoy looking at them so anyways yeah I just wanted to get on here and say a few things and show you guys a few of my pieces um, but yeah, feel free to leave some comments and I'll answer any questions that you guys might have or if you guys have any input or anything like that, I'd love to hear from you. So, um, this is I Pick Em Up. It's uh, Father's Day, so happy Father's Day to all you fathers out there um, and happy hunting. Uh, we'll see you, see you around.